All right, YouTube, what's up? It's your boy, JMMA here, man. I'm back with another man. We got a, the, the Q&A that I was talking to y'all about. We got the Q&A. You know what I'm saying? I got the, I got the, I got the struggle Chinese food in the microwave. You know what I'm saying? I got the, I had to throw a little parsley on top of the orange chicken. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. The Lissy Ocean. And I got the, I got the water. I got my laptop right here, so we're gonna read some of these questions. I'm gonna fuck this food up. Simple, so let's get right into it. All right, the first question we got, man, comes from my guy, Blade. And Blade asks, how does it feel to finally hit 1K after all the relentless nights, all the dedication, and through all the times you felt like quitting, but had to grind it up? How does it feel? And congratulations on the success. Shout out to Blade. Um, I don't know, man. I'm happy, but also I'm like, now the next goal is like 1.5, 1500. You know, I'm definitely feeling like, now that I got, you know, 1K, I feel like I, I, I can do more now. You know, cause I thought 1K was then near impossible for me when I first started. And now that I'm, you know, actually at 1K, I feel like I can, I can hit 50k, honestly, 10k, 5k, 2k, fuck, I can hit anything, you know, so, but, answer your question, um, it feels good, it feels good though, um, I'm happy for myself, I accomplished a lot with this, and um, yeah, I just feel happy for myself, man, you know, staying up all night, editing, Motherfucking nights I don't get sleep. And I got work a class in the morning. And for me to hit one K man, it's crazy. It's crazy, man. I'm still on I won't say it hasn't hit me yet, but I'm still in awe. You know what I mean? Like damn I hit one K, I did that. Obviously I had help from a plethora of people, but I was like, damn, I, I did it, you know? So it feels good man. Alright, so the next question we got man. What made you do YouTube and make Banker UFC 4 content? Um, my guy Cody Bank, right? So, I already know about Prioxys. I competed in like two of Prioxys as a um, calf tourney, so I know about him through Cody, but I've been supporting Cody for like a cool minute now. And, um, during the pandemic, really, when that first like started and everything, I was watching Cody like damn near every day. So I was like, damn, if he can do it, why can't I do it? You know, obviously, Marshall Mine was a big inspiration, and along the way, probably became a big inspiration. Just his growth to see was crazy. But also, man, shout out to Soul Illuminati, bro. If y'all can't tell, I'm highly inspired by him. Soul Illuminati, man, like, the way he entertains, you know, the entertainment side of it, I was like, when I start, I wanna do it like him. Not exactly like him, but I wanna entertain people like he does. And I, I know I've always been told that, you know, I'm funny in school, I've been in the jokester and shit, but. I never decided to start a YouTube and shit. Oh uh, well, now here I am, but I never like thought about YouTube like that, but those guys, man, they really inspired. They made me start doing it. Um, I posted my first video, was a, which was a Valentina video in December of 2020, I believe. Then I posted a Tony one. And those did like 30 views and I didn't even like promote it or anything. I, I didn't know anybody in the community like that. I was like, damn. I got 30 views and I ain't really doing nothing. Oh yeah, let me do another one. So I did a CM Punk one. And the CM Punk one did well. I was like, okay. Let me do a, a top, uh, a, a cheeser one. You know, beating a cheeser. That one got like 50 views. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna grind this. I'm gonna grind it. So then, I did a Woodley one, 
I did a uh, Cub Swanson, Paul Felder, Wolkanovski. I wasn't even doing calf ones. I was doing Yannis, Patty Pimblet, Randy Costa. Bro, I did King Kong versus fucking Demetrius Johnson. Like, I was doing it all, bro. So, yeah, man. That's what really made me want to swear. I know that was a, like a long drug out end. Next question. Do you have good bottom game? Y'all niggas is funny. We haven't been in my streams, bro. Um, there's a common joke that I like taking people down, testing their bottom game, which I do. Pause. 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 But... That's the question. I do have a good bottom game. My guard is very good, bro. I have a very good card, man. Shout out to Ola. What is your end goal? What is your life goal in the end? YouTube success or is that another passion? Um, obviously YouTube, you know. I want to be the best entertainer that I can be. Give y'all great content, things like that. I want to have channel memberships, merch. I want to do giveaways. I want to hit, like I said, 1.5K at the end of this year. Um, by March of next year, I want to have like two, like 2K around there. Um, so, I should go to fuck. But I want to, you know, do all those things for my YouTube goals. But I want to, I want to compete in like, I want to do competitive play with ESBC. And hopefully UFC 5. I'm gonna get back into it when UFC 5 comes out. I want you guys a competitive play. You know, that's another thing I wanna do. Um I also wanna <laughs> This is what I'll be fighting. I also wanna commentate, man. I really, I think I'm a good commentator. I'm entertaining enough. I got the voice for it and everything. I love like to commentate a, an event, but it is IRL or esports thing. I would love to commentate one. Um, I also, I want to start interviewing fighters. Shout out to my guy, Fred Talks Fighting. I really want to start interviewing fighters and things like that. So, those are just some goals and you know, some passions for me. Drake, Soulcom X, anything new upcoming for the channel? Any anything new or upcoming for the channel, not there is need to be wondering. Um obviously my martial mind collab. Um me and Pry are gonna be doing the rematch, so we got that. Uh me and Dave are gonna be doing some stuff. Like I said before, fighter interviews, y'all should be on the lookout for. Um a lot of stuff, man. I've been getting asked this a lot about the round table. Round tables will be coming back, man. Look how look how look how scrumptious that chicken look, man. Cook cook nicely, thoroughly. You know. And my fucking round table coming back. We made our own channel and everything, so content coming on there for it. But for my channel, man, I just wanna um start to get better at my craft. I want to start doing stuff like that. So, if you see me like trying out new thumbnails, like the new thumbnails I've been trying out, I've been, yeah, it, and it, it looks simple, but it's new and fun to me. So, I've been trying out new shit like that. So, I'm thanks coming. I'm trying to look out for that too. Oh shit. Stay on the lookout for that, man. Oh shit. The next question is from Austin. Austin asks, uh, will you ever collab with Marshall Mind? I don't know, man. Um, Marshall. He's a busy guy, man, so. I don't know, Brian wants to do a collab with him. I want to collab. Crooks wants to collab. There's a lot of people who want to collab with Marshall, so. I just got to wait in line, man. That's all that is. I really just gotta wait in line for my for my opportunity. That's all I have, man. So that's gonna be coming soon, man. So yeah, man. We'll, we'll see. Long time OG Ed, man. Shout out to Ed, bro. Ed X, man. Um, am I getting flown from the to the US anytime soon? Fuck 
Yeah, bro. Um, I don't know, it. We'll see, bro. Maybe we go to a UFC event, something like that, man, but. I'd definitely be something cool, you know, we can hang out with my UK bros fam. You know, hang out with my UK bros, you know, so. That'd be cool, man. That'd be cool. Alright, um, next question is, which YouTuber do you think brought your channel up more? Uh, in terms of, I who talked about me the most? I don't know, man. It's between Brian and Cody. Cody, Brian and Cody have brought my channel up, like, so much, so. It's definitely between them. But as far as, you know, who gave me the momentum I'm on right now, Pride, Cody, and Marshall, man. Those three, bro. Without them, I probably wouldn't be on this momentum kick that I'm on right now, so. I also ran into my video in, what, like, August? And it's October, and I'm still, like, riding that momentum, man. So, it just talks about my work ethic, man. So, shout out to those three, man. But, yeah. Those dudes. Let's see. Flex money drizzle eggs. Who's your favorite channel member? Oh, my favorite channel member is. That's hard, man. Hey, we don't have channel members. It's family members. My favorite. I want to have like a one soul favorite. I have plenty though. And obviously Jonathan, Ethan. DJ, Troy, AJ, Vito, Oli, Austin, Cody. It's like so many. Uh, DS. It's like so many people, man. I can't give it with names, so. Yeah, man. Like, that, that's, that's really it, bro. That's the end of the motherfucking Q&A, man. It literally finished right on time, because I'm damn near done with this fucking food. Hold on. How a real nigga eat, man. All right, y'all. Like, comment, subscribe, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this. This was fun, though. I should do like more content like this, but it was fun, though. We hit 1K, man, but we on we really on the grind now. Oh, um, we really on the grind. 1.1K coming soon. More content, everything coming soon, man. So y'all stay on the lookout. Uh, yeah, that's all I got to say, man. Peace, love, prosperity. See y'all next time. It's your boy. JMMA man and remember if you haven't joined the family already man hit that subscribe button man join the family join the gang man see y'all next time man and remember do something productive with your day remember beating your meat is not productive it's not productive my guy all right see y'all next time man love all y'all man it's your boy JMMA and I'm out man peace